Well, this is my boy Gavin Slink. How you guys doing? Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, depending on where you guys are watching this video from. I hope you guys are very much doing okay. I said it before. I said it yesterday again, and I'll be saying it all over, and I will keep continuing to say it. Big Brother Ninja is a calculated distraction. Big Brother Ninja is a calculated distraction in Ninja. I'm not going to play into their game. I'm not. I'm not going to play into that uh, that rugged game. Well, everyone is entitled to whatever he or she wants to use his time for. But I'm also entitled to talk about it as well. But firstly, let us uh, move to other stuff first. This is a really beautiful morning here in Ninja. And I want to use this opportunity to greet all my viewers. Good morning, good afternoon, good evening. Uh, depending where you are watching this video from, I really appreciate your uh, your patronage. Yes, if I may call it that. And also, I appreciate your comments so far concerning the trending issue that we had the other day. Our I even came alive yesterday just to address the issue about David Doe and uh, the Muslim communities in Nigeria. We're talking about David Doe and Muslim communities in Nigeria. Hmm? I also want to share you a statement for one of your Christian sister who was formerly part of Big Brother Nigeria. This girl's name is Ifu Nada. She posted some really ridiculous pictures recently and she said, I have given my giving my life to Christ. He posted, oh God, the outfit is so ridiculous. Then she said, happy birthday to me. Sinner saved by his grace and welcome into royalty. On this day, I would like to announce that I have officially given my life to Christ. Yes, I am born again. The past few years saw me stray from Christ and live in life that almost ended me. But his mercy saved me, and even though it has not been easy overcoming my flesh and living this new life, I am committed to stay on the new path to part of eternal life in Christ. This is deep meaning behind, there is a deep meaning behind these photos. I am using to celebrate my day and announce my new life. Don't be in a rush to condemn me without having an understanding of the message it carries. Oh God, you want to give your life to Christ, then you are posting these kind of pictures. You are saying nobody should condemn you because there's a deep meaning behind it. See, I don't want anybody to contradict me. I don't want anybody to say, oh, Adam, why are you saying this? Hmm? When people say Muslims take all their religion strongly in a way that they do not like anybody to disrespect their religion. They don't like to, they don't tolerate whenever anybody disrespects their religion. Hmm? Good and fine. Christians in the other way allow people to disrespect their religion. Good and fine. Respect Muslims for not allowing tolerance. And let me again expatiate this tolerance. We Muslims. According to the book, we don't tolerate the the uh, taking of another person's life. It's highly prohibited. I've said this severally. Anybody who indulge in that kind of evil thing and said it's a Muslim, no, no, no. I don't think that person is reading the right Muslim. There are so many other things again we do not participate in. But when you come online to portray what you do not practice, you say that Muslim. It's bad. 
I even saw a video of some Muslim brothers yesterday dancing inside the mocks, shaking their waist, not in Nigeria, in one uh, Africa or Arab country, dancing, shaking their waist inside the mocks. I strongly criticize it. It is not right. That, was, that is not according to the preachings. It is not right. So, well, David O did the needful yesterday and he finally deleted the video. After much more pressure, <laughs> he deleted the video. So, yeah, internet will make you one game mind. Or say, no, do one. I'll be with the apple. If they think they are put to run, eh, you know, go day day. You just carry go they push person do what you know supposed to do. But if they, if you call the get the repercussion, you will not be there. Someone said the God that hasn't dealt with us still you. Bolame Tunubu and other politicians. You know, God works in mysterious will. Dealing with somebody might not be. If God want to deal with somebody, it might not be the way you want him to deal with the person. It's dealing with that person, even unknown to you. You must not see the way God operates of other people's life. You must, you must not see it. Eh? It's only few that God allow you to see. Do you know the sleepless night, the health issue, and so many other things? Do you know if God put a hole in your heart that can never be filled? Do you know that's a punishment? A hole in your heart, hollow. No matter the achievement that you will have, you will never be fulfilled in this life. Don't you know that's a punishment? Do you think God will punish people according to the way you want him to? Who be you? See, man. <laughs> Allow God to deal with people according to the way he fits. It's not, it's not dealing with people, people because of you. Uh, people will say, oh, God is not dealing with other people. If they deal with them, but not in your own way. Huh? So, uh, firstly, I, I don't want to say thanks to David Doe for deleting that video, honestly. I don't want to use that word. So, I said, David Doe deleting that video, he, he, fooled, he fooled at last as expected. The most listeners comes from Nigeria. People are attending his concert are Nigerians, so it is only right he deletes, he deleted. I thought he will leave it, but this time, next year, he might join NICE in doing door-to-door -door campaign for APC. Then uh, Basha Ahmed said, it is good to discover that David O deleted that offensive and awful video. Hopefully, the entire scene will also be deleted from the actual footage before releasing it to the market. And we humbly hope that the same grave mistake should never happen again from him or anyone else. Nigeria is a beautiful country. It is always amazing when it is uh, celebrate the beauty of living in unity and harmony while embracing our differences. I bet this guy, although he's making sense, but a very rigid person, so I beg you know, I know they like it words. You do it making sense, so but because of what you don't do. Then Shaki said, David has finally deleted the video, but that is just the first step. We are waiting for an unreserved apology towards the Muslim woman he made a mockery of. Then Daniel Rega said, Okay, that was when. The director said David Doe hasn't apologized to Muslim, but instead is trying to suppress the issue by donating $10,000 $10, to a lady who returned in misplaced $70K. This is also coming from someone who is yet to fulfill the $20 million promise he made to a tap renewal since 2022. It costs nothing to say sorry. <laughs> David Doe will not say sorry. See, this is what it is. If David Doe hasn't made any form of speech, man, any form of anything, as soon as there was hearing that thing, doesn't even talk. People should, I think David Doe should have a lot of uh, uh, people around him to control this media, uh, the way he uses social media, honestly. 
He shouldn't respond to every critics. Don't respond. Don't even seem listen like you are, you are responding by posting anything. Don't. If he has kept quiet, may other two days or three days to read the video, then nobody will say nothing. But then the reader, David Doe don't donate another money the other day, he announced it. What is the 20 million naira you are still talking about today? And also, you know the girl that David Doe gave 10,000 US dollars. In fact, uh, the girl out of video called David Doe yesterday and prayed for David Doe, thanked David Doe for the 10,000 US dollars. You know how much 10,000 US dollars? That is 8.5 million naira for this ad economy. 8.5 billion naira, just like that, for this very, very, very difficult economy. How about that? Is <laughs> that one? That one is more true. So big up for big up to David Do for that. And David Do said, I needed the prayer. He said, I needed that prayer. David Do is just who he is. Everybody should understand him. Although people might not agree with him, the guy they do, they show off. He has always been like that. He can never stop. You understand? That was giving joy. That's what makes him happy. To give and also show people that he's giving. Although that might, not, that might not be the practice of every other person out there. You know, whenever anybody talks, they say, you don't they give at all. You they give at all. There are people who give a lot, but they will never, ever, ever speak it out. Yes, yeah, so, though. That people will give you, give yourself, you'll tell you the only thing I want from you, eh? The only thing I want from you is that don't allow the next person to hear that I gave you anything. Yes, there are people like that. They'll give you and they will make you promise not to tell another person. They think they chop you for mine. You made a give money. Say you want hard to find out, but you have made a promise. There are people like that. But notwithstanding, he's still a great guy. Eh? And he gets his own blessing from there. Uh, so big up to him though. Then let's talk about Big Brother Ninja. Big Brother Ninja is a calculated distraction. During the hand size, they bring Big Brother Ninja to distract you. During uh during which other okay i i wrote uh, i tweeted it on my twitter yesterday i said i think big brother ninja is a calculated distraction during the nsas election campaign and now subsidy and four increment they just started a new season to distract many nigerians from worrying about their suffering and stomach they know they worry about four again. Who will even get money to buy data? Who will even get money to buy data? Do, do you know every day in RDS TV and Go TV they increase their money? Because people are already going, going to other things. They are already looking for other if you know if it's not before. What else? Ball and CNN. Now people know they watch CNN and BBC again like that. Because of the propagandas. So it's not be he, all those things waiting again. But for Ninja, a big brother Ninja be the new something. I'm not saying nobody should get entertained. Though. Someone said the other day, ah, what we go do now? A big brother Ninja we get now. Maybe we watch and until they pull our tape and that. Oh, it's good. The media saying the people who brought out the media are so wise. It's to suppress your way of thinking. Is to suppress you of thinking about the next meal. Mm? It's good though if you want to feel entertained. I'm not criticizing it, but I'm just saying I feel it's a calculated distraction. Because if you check the way that they bring them out, it's a calculated distraction. It's a calculated one. I'm big up to those people who are making money from this whole thing. You know, good and fine for them. But I believe it's a calculated destruction. Just imagine the trends now. Talking about this one. Talking about, did you know what is going on now between 
Peter Obi and uh, Tinubu in court. Do you you hear the latest? No. Well, that's exactly what I'm going to talk about in, in, in my next video. Well, it's a calculated distraction for me. Understand? But this kind of foil something though. Boom! <clears throat> Big brother and Nigeria, all stars. Okay, guys, thank you very much for watching. It's a boy here, Adam Slain. Have a wonderful day. Stay blessed. Catch you next time. And please make sure you leave your comments. Bye.